Hey guys, uh, I've noticed a lot of people having trouble finding uh, Badger Perfect Pelts, so in this video I'm going to explain how to uh, go about finding them and show you the best locations to do so. You need three pelts if you want to craft everything in the game, but the majority of people just want one for that satchel, the legendary satchel. So here's a Badger, I'm using a Varmint Rifle, always use a Varmint Rifle, uh, I've got a scope on this one. And for this location, it's uh, best to hunt here in the evening, um, this is where I found, uh, when I found this Badger here, it was about 7.30, 7.40pm in the game time. And yeah, uh, basically you want to be riding around on your horse and aiming with the varmint rifle, locking on to everything. You'll probably lock on to a lot of uh, jackrabbits, but eventually you'll get that badger. And I recommend, um, so yeah, this is the location. There it is, north of Rhodes. I recommend uh, if you do run into a badger and it's not a three star, then just to leave that area and try one of these other locations because if you kill it and then wait around it's going to be a very long time for another badger to respawn you might have to um, camp a few times for a badger to actually respawn because they got a low spawn rate as it is and yeah this location um, it's actually on the map it's got a badger symbol it's best to hunt here at night for the badger um, I find and yeah this badger is a three star as well so um, that was my third badger I think third perfect pelt and then basically save if you do finally get that perfect pelt uh, save instantly so that you know and there's the location because you definitely don't want to um, lose the the pelt after spending all that time trying to get it um, this location is actually south of Rhodes. On in the um, compendium, it says that the badger only appears in sort of arid climates, which means like dry and warm. So yeah, in the south, um, you'll definitely find badgers. Uh, the trick is to get it to be three star, because you do find those one and two star ones. What I have done before is I've found a two star badger, and then using the buck trinket supposedly you can change some two stars to three stars and I've had it happen before for rabbits and squirrels but what I did was kill the two star badger and save and then I reloaded and kept skinning it and I can't actually confirm that this works because I, I must have reloaded about 30 times and I did not get a perfect pelt um, and eventually I just thought that it was not a very sound strategy and it's probably once the badge is killed then it sort of must lock in whether you're going to get a um, up, upgrade on it or not with the trinket so uh, that this theory isn't like 100% though so maybe if you I don't know reload it a hundred times you might get the perfect pelt but I think it's easier just to go for the three star straight off the bat in this clip I'm too uh, afraid to body shot it because um, you want to go for the headshots if you can because there is a tiny chance that if you go for a body shot um, you're, you're going to devalue the pelt even though you're using the varmint rifle I've heard that happen to a couple of other people before so you definitely don't want that to happen so I'm using dead eyes you know another way to do it but you definitely want to go for the headshots if you can but if it's running around like that you can risk losing it like I almost lost that badge uh, excuse me, and yeah, there's the location south of Rhodes, but a bit to the right. Um, it's a great uh, spot for badger hunting. And then here I'm back at that other place where it's best to hunt at night. It's very early in the morning here. Um, this was the first badger I ever found, and I was pretty stoked to uh, actually get it. And yeah. And now I've caught uh, four badges now, perfect, perfect pelts, so it is doable. I know it can seem impossible, and if you're trying to find the badger and it's been a long time and you still haven't found the three star, I recommend doing something else just to t take your mind off it and then having another crack at it later because 
it can make you start to really dislike playing the game and it's a good game Red Dead Redemption 2 so you don't want that yeah so like I'm doing here I'm just running around locking on to everything I can and then I'm seeing you know what animal it is if it's a bird or a deer or a raccoon like just before I'll ignore it and yeah there we go I spotted a three star American Badger And in this one I go for the headshot as well. But this location, um, I've heard from other people, is one of the best. And one strategy is to sleep in the day and hunt at night in this location. But yes, if you do get a two-star badger and kill it, I recommend trying another location instead of just staying around in the same location. Because it's going to be a long time before that badger will respawn. So yeah, uh, good luck everyone, and I hope this video helped in understanding how to hunt badgers, and yeah, hopefully the badger won't drive you crazy, and yeah, defy that badger. Happy hunting.